Why do the rich get richer? Why do the rich get richer? As the famous quote says, the first million dollar is the most difficult. It's a cliche because there is truth to it. Every millionaire claims that their first million was the hardest. The second million was simpler to make than the first, and the third million was more easily obtained than the second. And each million after that became easier than the previous million. Those who are already wealthy have a huge advantage in the game. There is an article about Ringo Starr, the Beatles' legendary drummer. He expressed something in his article that is strange but true. When Ringo was a young man, starting out in music, all he wanted was a decent drum set. He didn't have any money and had to claw and scrape to save up for a great drum set that he had his eye on. No one tried to support him with the buy. He was financially on his own to make it happen. Now, after earning the fame and money, he gets offered free drums all the time from companies. In reality, he can not only get free drums, but he can also get companies to pay him to use their drums. Ringo thought it was ironic that no one helped him when he was young, broke, and in desperate need for money. But now that he's wealthy, famous, and can't afford any drum set in the world, he can get free drums all day. It appears that the less one needs, the more one receives. Is this fair, you may ask? It's difficult to say because it all depends on your perspective, of course. However, this is the way how the world works nowadays. The world rewards those who have more. Many wealthy people can relate to the story Ringo Starr shared. It's not just unique to him. That is why there is the old cliche, the rich keep getting richer. We have another example. Consider Jim. Jim is a real person with a different name. He presented his story at a university where he spoke about his professional life and career. Jim earned relatively little money when he first began his professional career as a corporate assistant. Over the two decades, he climbed to the corporate ladders, increasing both his income and his net worth. And his corporate duties grew. More and more service vendors offered him free meals at excellent restaurants and tickets to sporting events as a means of developing relationships. No service vendor offered to take him to a wonderful lunch at the Michelin starred restaurant or box seat tickets to into a baseball game at Madison Square Garden where he first began out in his corporate position with a very little money to spend. Now that he has more spending power, he is offered complimentary tickets and beautiful dinners. The reasons the rich get richer. There are good reasons why the rich are getting richer. Hopefully, this video won't inspire jealousy or hate for the wealthy. The goal of this video is to show that there are reasons why it is simpler for the wealthy to accumulate more wealth than the typical person. And those relations have nothing to do with being evil, being a bad person, or conducting criminal crimes as the general population is made to believe. Instead of hoping that the rich will fail, let us try to join them so that we can get all the benefits of wealth. Reason number one, the wealthy place a greater value on their time. You expect to be paid for your time and effort when you go to work. We hope that seems logical to all of us, except for a few politicians who feel you should be highly taxed for your efforts while receiving very little in return. If the economy is doing well, you should only take a job if it is paid at least what you consider a fair wage for your time. If the job doesn't pay you what you believe you should make, you would walk away and hunt for a new employment. The wealthy feel the same way. But since they have a larger asset pool, they place on a higher value on their time. We all work for money based on what we think is a reasonable value for our time. Because they are already wealthy, the wealthy feel that a bigger payment amount is deserved for their time. They typically compare income with their asset pool. $100,000 a year may sound appealing to someone with $25,000 in assets. However, if you have $10 million in assets, $100,000 a year in compensation for working a job may not sound as appealing. In actuality, $100,000 annual income then has little impact on their overall net worth. Therefore, the rich will choose to work on something that can generate a bigger pay. Hopefully, this makes sense to you and is one of the reasons why the rich keep getting richer. Due to their financial ability, they value their time more. Reason number two. The rich have income producing assets. In this world, work isn't the only trade for money. People also pay to use some assets. 
These are known as income producing assets and wealthy people have a lot of them. Real estate is an example of an asset that generates income. People will pay to live or work in your residential or commercial property. Another example of an income producing asset is cash. By borrowing your money, banks will charge you interest. Also, stocks can be forgotten and will grow in value and pay dividends if the companies do well. The wealthy have more income generating assets that will create cash flow and continue to increase their net worth by purchasing more and more assets. Reason number three, the rich have money and can purchase unique or rare items that will increase. Kevin O'Leary of Shark Tank fame acquired a Patek Philip 5711 watch. It is the steel Nautilus with a blue dial. This model of watch is no longer produced. The year 2021 marked the end of production. At the time, the watch cost roughly around $30,000 in the United States. The watch was so popular that there was a multi-year wait list for it. Kevin O'Leary said that he was on the wait list for 8 years before getting his hands on the watch. Because of the strong demand, the price of the watch in the secondhand market inflated to over $60,000 at the time of Kevin's purchase. People who did not want to wait a few years to get the watch from an authorized dealer drove up to the secondary market price of that watch. Kevin was able to achieve a rapid 100% return on his investment after purchasing the watch for $30,000. The Patek Philip 5711 continues to move up in value on the secondary market given the strong demand for high-end steel sports watches. It sells for roughly $100,000 today, but at one point, the Patek Philip 5711 was listed for almost $200,000. The wealthy have the means to purchase rare, one-of-a-kind and pricey products. Reason number four, they have better investment opportunities. This is not corrupt or criminal in any way. In actuality, there are laws that restrict access to certain assets to the wealthy only. Consider a private equity fund or a PE fund investment. PE funds by law are only offered to the accredited investors. To be an accredited investor, a person must have either 1. An annual income surpassing $200,000 or $300,000 for combined income for previous two years with expectations of receiving the same or higher income in the current year, or 2. A net worth of over $1 million, excluding the value of residence. The law is placed in place to safeguard the typical person from receiving exposure to what the government regards as difficult to comprehend and riskier products. In other words, you have to be wealthy in order to profit from a PE fund investment. Reason number five, rich people have better financing options. The wealthy have greater access to capital. That should come as no surprise. They have two advantages over the average person. One, assets, and two, a high income. Lenders work to help people by lending them money. In exchange, the lenders must recover their investments and collect interest. Lenders can reduce their risk of not receiving their money back by requiring collateral on the loan. Why may banks lend at a better rate on a mortgage than on a personal loan? Your home is used as security for your mortgage, which is the reason why. The wealthy have assets, particularly income generating assets. A loan could be secured by those assets. As a result, the wealthy have more financial opportunities. Furthermore, a lender wants a high level of income to cover the interest payments. The wealthy have more cash than the average individual. That makes the lenders feel more at peace. Banks may also offer better loan terms if you have more assets with them. Some banks provide a quarter point or more in interest rate discounts on mortgages if you reach specified asset thresholds with them. This also permits the wealthiest to borrow at a lower rate. Reason number six, the wealthy have more power. Some of the wealthy have risen to positions of power because they own businesses or have a lot of followers. They have a lot of sway over their employees and customers. This type of influence is also quite valuable and can generate a lot of money. Take for example, Kylie Jenner. She is the member of the Kardashian family. Kylie Jenner's net worth was projected to be $1 billion by Forbes magazine in 2019, making her the world's youngest self-made billionaire at the time. Her billionaire status has since been reassessed by Forbes. However, she is still extremely wealthy, even if she's not a billionaire. She established a profitable cosmetic line, which contributed significantly to her net worth. 
Kylie used her massive Twitter and Instagram followers to promote her cosmetic line. Her followers on Instagram stood at 375 million at the time of publishing this video. She should be able to sell a lot of whatever goods she wants to promote to her followers with that many followers. The level of power she has over her followers enables her to collect the massive wealth. Reason number seven, rich people have better connections. This could be a self-made circle. People in general assume that the wealthy have stronger connections. Improved connections can lead to more opportunities. People desire to connect with someone wealthy because they want to have more options. As a result, the wealthy have more contacts. In Silicon Valley, startup companies with enormous potential can readily attract money. However, some startups want more than just simply money. They also want the advice and connections that a new equity partner can provide. If you can only provide finance to a startup, you will lose out another prospective investor who can provide both funds and relationships. The wealthy have greater connections and those connections provide better investment opportunities for them to continue their wealth accumulation. Reason number eight, the wealthy can use others to create output. The rich people can afford to hire extra people who can help offer leverage as needed. The average person does housework to keep their home in order. Some of the tasks include raking leaves, cleaning the house, washing, cooking, and grocery shopping. Those tasks are necessary in order to live an organized life. They do not, however, directly generate income. The wealthy can hire someone to do such tasks. Instead of the wealthy, might just use the time they would have spent doing chores to work on projects or tasks that would generate money or income. The wealthy can also hire a large number of individuals to assist with income generating businesses or projects. Instead of exchanging only one person's time for money, the wealthy can exchange the time of numerous employees for money. Imagine the owner of a law or an accounting firm to understand how they use other people's time. Reason number nine, the rich have access to more information. The wealthy have more knowledge or access to knowledge than the average person. Information can lead to increased wealth and income. There are several reasons why the wealthy have more information. The wealthy might have more time to do the research. They might have become wealthy because they specialize in a certain field. The wealthy may also have more connections and relationships, which can lead to better education and information from other specialists in a given sector. The information that the wealthy have can be beneficial and lead to increased wealth building chances. So it is easier to make money when you are wealthy. Hopefully, you now understand why this is the case with the reasons we discussed. Don't hate the wealthy because of their ability to earn income and wealth. Wouldn't you take advantage of the benefits if they were made available for you? This should give you even more drive to become wealthy. When you become wealthy, a wide range of new possibilities for income and wealth open up to make you richer.